So welcome back everyone. It is, what day is it? Is it Sunday? You want to go some more? She doesn't like to stop. It's uh, Sunday. We are, uh, we're up at the mountain. skiing so it looks like we're gonna have a white christmas yeah. christmas eve is tomorrow yeah. and we woke up to about four inches of snow and we thought let's go for a drive we'll take a picnic lunch we'll take the sweet loaf up <laughs> pull around a little bit you love it she sure is grumpy when you're not pulling her she you want more 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 you want to pull her around a little bit i'd love to ready here we go watch out mama's a fear devil Do you want, hey, do you want cucumbers or we have, can she have some cheese here? Yeah, she can have everything. We have some crackers. special cheese from Ireland. Yes, that's really extra sharp. How's that? We have some little cuties. Little cuties. Thanks, baby. No, you think I'm cute. Cute. Oh, the cheese may have been a little too sharp. Let's go up top and grab our seat. got a one in three chance of getting it right, right? Grab my gloves. Yeah, you're also very, very wet. How are things shaping up in here? Good. This is not going to be long enough. I need my ball of cloth. Are you ready, sweet loaf? Are you going to bring a book? Right, baby. I don't think you need a ball of cloth. Okay. I think you're going to be working hard. I'm going to make you pull a sled. I can do that. I thought that's why you married me. No, I'm going to pull a sled. My granddad always said you wanted to marry a strong woman, a woman that could pull a plow. That's me. For whatever that means. <laughs> I don't know that I want a woman that could pull a plow. I so mind. remember that. Just make sure you wear, or marry a woman that can pull a plow. What if you fall in love with someone who's very, very small? Well, it could be a small plow. <laughs> like for a flower garden. Like a dog plow. Like a dog plow, yeah. A hoe. A hoe. <laughs> don't marry a hoe. I am in my element. This is what I was made to do. How is it, sweet low? That's pretty fun. It's a pretty good climb. I guess you can pull a plow. <laughs> I thought that's why you married me. We have a big downhill. We're gonna get some speed. I'm not. I'm not taking your down screamer. You gotta come back down this though. We're gonna go green. Lakeside. Yeah. Is it hard work? <laughs> it's definitely hard work. I should go on the tracks. It'd be easier. <laughs> See, where are we here? Oh yeah? She wants you to go faster. 
This is my winter song to you. Storm I know the snow is very sticky. Frozen from the sea. My voice a beacon in the night. My words will be your light to carry you to me. It's love alive. It's love alive. It's love. Mrs. W is a lot better skier than I am. She actually competed in and finished a race in Sweden called the, if I remember right, the Vassal, the Vassalopet, Vassalopet, I think. Am I confusing that with the ship? I'll have to ask her. Anyway, it's like a, it's like a 90 kilometer or 90 mile or something cross country ski race. And she did the whole thing from start to finish. It was, it was pretty impressive. So I'm lucky to be able to even keep up with her. I was telling everyone about that ski race you did. I always forget the name. Was it the Vassal Lopet or is that the name of the I, ship? I think everybody knows about the ski race. Right? No, I, well, I, give me an opportunity to be proud of you. What was the ski race you did? Vassal Lopet. Vassal Lopet. Yeah. And it was far, like is it 90 kilometers or it 90 miles? It was 90 kilometers, which is about 55, 56 miles. All on cross-country skis. All on cross-country skis. Were you one of the few Americans competing in it? I was. American women. The year that I did it, there were 14,000 people who did the real race. And there were 13,000 men and about 1,000 women. And so the men had white bibs, we had yellow bibs. And they put flags on your, if you're a foreigner, they put flags on. So I had oh, a yellow nice. bib plus an American flag. So, hey, uh, you know, <laughs> go lady, go lady. You know, so it was really fun. And lots of great blueberry soup is what you drink. Yeah, I tried blueberry soup once and I didn't I didn't really think it was great. Well, after, you know, seven, eight hours of skiing, you think it's great. I guess I expect it to be sweeter. Oh, it's not, yeah, not super sweet. Yeah, sweets don't like things as sweet as Americans do. Yeah. Yeah. It's more savory than sweet. I think she looks done. Done. Are you D. ready? Let's go, D. Looks like an abominable snowman, snow baby. All right, lead on, let's get out of here before it gets dark. I didn't bring any headlamps. Probably a quarter mile from the car. Yeah. So a quarter mile in or so is the, I'm gonna show you the lodge. So it's a, there's a fireplace in there and you can go in and warm up a little bit. It's such a wonderful facility, isn't it? Yeah, it's getting dark. Yeah, it's four, what time is it? It's 4.10, so it'll be dark at 4.30. Yeah. We're gonna head back to the van and then we'll uh, head on down to town. Sounds good. You're so nice and wave. What were you saying? I said, how was it to use the ladder in the snow? Oh, it, was, it was fine. It's uh, really easy to get up. I think I'm gonna put some skateboard tape on the rungs, but I didn't find it to be bad. That's it's like good. it's like having a cabin. It's awesome. It is so nice. Furnace is on. Oh, I just love it. All right, let's get the the loaf packaged up here, or unpackaged. All right, baby girl, we made it. Let me get my, my skis off here. These are good. Oh, things. yours are e easy, the oh, easy valentines. Just the best. The best bindings. How are you doing? Come on, let's see. How'd you do? You got a lot of snow on you. Hey, baby. Oh! Yay! <laughs> Yay! That startled me. Yay! Show the the <laughs> the wall, the snow wall there. The snow plow threw snow over top of the. That was awesome. The snow plow just came right down here and threw snow. Was not anticipating that, were you? Not at all. Yay! Here we go. Here, Here we go. go. Oh, come on. Yeah, Are you ready? let's give you the jack while come we get everything ready. You, let's put you inside. Jack, oh, we have a special goodness. delivery. Here we go. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Wow, you guys are snowy. Oh, look at this. Hi, baby. Let's, Let's get you out of your snowsuit. I'm gonna get my snow off. You wish you would have come out with us, Jack? No. No? Off the radio, because otherwise you'll have copyrighted music. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, that's probably a good idea. And it might just be bad music. No. <laughs> yes. Where's your zipper at? Hi, baby. What did you think? Oh, you want to eat? Always. Let me get eat. you out of your snowsuit, and then we'll get you some. Do you want a pear? Apple? Oranges? Sauerkraut? Cut your arms. Crackers? Cook your arms. There we go. Nice to get that off. It's a little. It's a little bulky, isn't it? Yeah. What do you want? You, you want pear? Pear. I think that was thank you. Oh, you're welcome. You work up a powerful hunger when you go cross country skiing, don't you? <laughs> yeah, your cheeks are red and. She doesn't oh. feel cold though. No, her hands, her feet are all warm. She's good. That sled is all insulated. It's got double insulation underneath of it for the snow, so she's uh, pretty snug in that thing. Plus, she's wearing. All right, like Jack. I'm gonna pass. Uh, I'm gonna pass the loaf off to you, and then Mom and I are gonna go load up the skis. Right. So, can you watch her for a minute? Yeah. We low. Here we go. Here we go. You look all snowy. Hi. So I figured out something we need to do, baby. What's that, love? For the uh, van. Boop. Is we need to have a whole mm -hmm. bunch of hooks. You're wet. Because we we've got all this wet clothing that needs to kind of drip and no I, place to hang it. I think great minds think alike. Because yeah. I, I may have. Thought the same exact yeah. thing. We'll put. We'll definitely put some hooks up there. Okay. So let's. Uh, can you hand the skis up to me, and we'll um, we'll get going. Yeah. How much snow do you think we're gonna get? I don't know what. what what's the elevation here? They're probably a thousand feet higher than us. Yeah. If I, had to, if I had to guess. Well, um, I don't think they're quite as. Uh, I don't know that they. I think they might be higher than that, but I don't think they get as much snow because when you're at our elevation, further down the mountain. They didn't have as much snow as we normally do. It could be. We it, so we had. Uh, I think we had between four and five inches at our place this morning, and if it snowed all day today, we could have a foot when we get home. Guess what I'm doing when I get home? What are you doing? It's full moon. Let's throw our snowshoes on and, and head out. A night ski. Yeah. We'll put our headlamps on. That and, would be fun. Yeah. We'll uh, grab Jack and put the the loaf in and grab her mommy. She can go to bed. She can be tired. Got him? Got him. Yeah, it's uh, it's almost dark. That, yeah. that uh, phone really does a good job. I was just thinking about how it looks like it's daytime in the phone and it looks like nighttime in real life. Yeah. Oh, but it was cold, cold. Whew. Uh oh. You might have to dig out. Look what that snow plow did, huh? I'm so glad we left. Nothing like an adventure van. You know, some people build that whole back out with all cargo, you know, cargo bins and all that. It's nice just to have that pass through. We, it's, we use it all the time for surfboards and all sorts of stuff. Let's grab our poles. Oh my god, then she started padding it. Sweet love, what does the T Rex say? Cuter? I don't think so. I don't think so. No bias at all, right? Jack, what Jack is a lion the cutest, Jack, who is the cutest little boy? Yeah. Who is it you? Please never do that so again. So what's it like? <laughs> <laughs> what's it like having a baby sister? Oh, she's a pain. Oh, she's a pain. <laughs> you love her. You want to go skiing again? More? Thank you. 